by and large, the, if, if the people's votes were reflected the way that it should be, then I don't think we would go too far wrong. I think it's, it's probably just as simple as the decisions decisions being made on their behalf um, and decisions like important decisions being being made on people's futures don't actually reflect what they stand for or what they believe in and so you tend to get a very a very small amount of people representing a very small portion of the country um, making decisions that affect the majority of people um, I've had a very mixed very mixed bag really I think I think I've had I've had a lot of both a lot of support and um, a decent amount of of negativity as well um, but I mean that that's just politics isn't it generally um, I do I, it does it, I do find it irritating a lot with the, the sort of stick to football type comment because um, realistically it's like saying to a fireman or um, a teacher or a postman or oh, stick stick to your, stick to your job and it's just like well no everyone's everyone's a member of society and everyone has has the right to an opinion and to express that opinion and and I'm fortunate that I have a platform as a footballer um a, you know a slight perhaps a slightly bigger pla platform than most to, to to sort of express my views if we'd have had proportional representation for the last election then the government would have voted like the parliament would have voted for for free school meals um and it shouldn't take uh, a famous footballer to make the government do the right thing because i think by and large the if if the people's votes were reflected the way that it should be then i don't think we would go too far wrong mm -hmm.